This is Coffee with God. And let us begin this day with the Word of God. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke, chapter 11, verses 37 to 41. The passage is taken from the Message Version of the Bible. When he finished that talk, a Pharisee asked him to dinner. He entered his house and sat right down at the table. The Pharisee was shocked and somewhat offended when he saw that Jesus didn't wash up before the meal. But the master said to him, I know you Pharisees buff the surface of your cups and plates so they sparkle in the sun, but I also know your insides are maggoty with greed and secret evil. Stupid Pharisees, didn't the one who made the outside also make the inside? Turn both your pockets and your hearts inside out and give generously to the poor. Then your lives will be clean, not just your dishes and your hands. The Gospel of the Lord. Let us now listen to a reflection on this passage by a Claritian missionary, Brother Desiderio Cheng. With the passage of time, the community of Jesus and his first followers came to be identified with dominion and power. From a symbol of ignominy, the cross had been identified with a sword as the so-called Christian countries colonized other peoples in the name of evangelization. And the institution that grew from that community of disciples had surrounded itself with laws and rituals regulating who should be included or excluded from God's people. What a change from the lowly Galilean who preached a gospel of inclusion. With our preoccupation with the externals and with what is proper, we have lost sight of what truly matters. Jesus taught us to call God our Father because we are all sisters and brothers in the one big family of God. He came and feasted with the sinners and the outcasts of society, touched the untouchables of his time and did not condemn anyone. But once we have been in his community, we make rules on who can be our sister or brother in this family that is not even ours but God's. No rule matters except the law of love. 